up welcome back to my channel if you're new hi welcome welcome to the little family i am amanda kate and today i will be showing you guys something that you guys requested in my last video so i'll be showing you my pandora bracelet so it is pretty full the only space i have is this right here um so it's pretty heavy i'm not gonna lie so i will be going through the story of each charm i do still have them in order of when i got them so every time i get them i put it in a certain order and i have that order um and i have a story associated to every one of them most of them are very very special to me so basically the pandora bracelet what it represents to me is that um, me and my mom and my grandma who just recently passed away about two months ago um every time that it's a like a holiday or a birthday we give each other a pandora charm and the last few years my aunt actually joined in as well so i have some matching ones with my aunt i have some matching ones with my mom and a lot of these are like milestones that when i've achieved them i would get the pandora charm that would match and represent that milestone so i have a lot of them that are like numbers so if it was like let's say my 16th birthday i would get the 16 charm um and i'm gonna try to kind of vaguely explain them because there's a lot so i'm not sure how long this video is going to be um i try to limit my videos to between 10 and 15 minutes so i'll try to speak fast and just kind of skim through um but these are very 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 special to me i usually wear this bracelet every single day and i stack it on top of my alex and annie so this is the big and little dipper just for me and my mom um so i like the stacked look i love the sound you guys love it too i have a lot of comments saying that you guys like the jingle of this so when i'm talking because i'm french and i talk with my hands um i love the sound of it i just love it i love how bougie it looks it's just so shiny so silver um so flashy and just the sound it's like christmas bells so let's get into the video so this is the bracelet close up so as you guys can see it is very very full <laughs> Uh, but I just love how dangly it is. This is as much room as I have, and I am looking to fill it up and then stack another one on top. Um, so let's get into the charms. This one is not necessarily the first one I got. I think I had maybe three or four charms on here before I got this one, but I will mention it first. I would always be scared to wear my Pandora bracelet because I didn't want it to open and fall off. So I would get gifts uh, charms as gifts and I would never wear it and since it's really expensive like I wanted to wear it I wanted to you know be proud that I got these gifts but I was always scared that it would fall so long story short my mom got me this to hold both sides so if this does open these two sides hold the bracelet so that it doesn't just fall onto the floor and I lose it now I actually got this bracelet on my sweet 16 so I got the bracelet as well as the first charm that just says 16 this bird represents my old pet i will put a picture uh tweety bird so if you know me personally you know that i grew up with a bird actually a little cockatiel and her name was tweety bird i had her for 10 years she was the love of my life um and she passed away uh, we had to put her down she was very very sick when i was 18 so i had her from ages 8 to 18 and the second one i got here is actually a guitar because my great uncle passed away and he was a musician and he left me his guitar so i did take uh, guitar lessons i was not very good though so i kind of stopped so the next one is this little bunny that i got on easter this one here is a music note because i took singing lessons but again i really was not good so let's not talk about that this one is a little ballet slipper a pair of ballet slippers with a pink diamond pink is my favorite color um and i used to do ballet when i was little i did ballet jazz and tap and then i was a um competitive figure skater i was gonna say professional not that good but i was a competitive figure skater um so anyways that is what the ballet slippers is this says daughter and it's a little heart that actually my mom has the mother and my mom and my grandma had the same ones as well this one here says niece and there's a little ladybug on here so my aunt has the aunt one and I love that little detail on here, the little heart. The next one is a cross. My grandma was very religious, so she gave me this, I believe, on Christmas. 
The next one I have is the Eiffel Tower. I did go to Paris on a student exchange. I was in grade nine, so that is to represent my trip to Paris. I actually had a great time. It was the first time I went to Europe, um, and I've never been anywhere else in Europe, but I would love to go back. This little gingerbread cookie man I got on Christmas as well. I just think he's so cute. The next one I got is this 18 one. So just very basic, it was my 18th birthday. The next one I got is the Statue of Liberty because I did go on a trip to New York City. I've actually been there a few times, I wanna say twice um, off the top of my head, but I would love to go back. It's especially great for shopping, so that is that one. This next one is my birthstone, which is garnet, and it actually matches my birthstone of my baby ring, so January babies, holla! <laughs> um, so it's just a four-leaf clover for good luck. I got it on my birthday, and obviously my birthstone. This one is when I graduated. I want to say I, that one was when I graduated high school. I think that was the high school graduation one because it was right after I turned 18. So I want to say this little hat is high school. If it's not high school, it's college, but it's super cute. This one here is a little seashell because my mom went on a trip. I think it was Hawaii and she got me a little seashell. And I love the little details of all of these charms. The next one I got is this angel wing. Um, I love angel wings and feathers. And so that is what I got. I actually have a tattoo of a feather, which is my first tattoo ever. And I just still absolutely love it. So that is the little angel wing here. 21, I got when I turned 21. This one here is a little diploma. These are so small, but um, it's a little diploma. And I think it says the year on it. Yeah, so it says 2018. And I graduated university in 2018. So the little hat was college. Um, this one is university. And now this one is from one of my good friends, Mal. So shout out to Mal. I know she watches my videos. Um, it says forever friends. So she got me that for Christmas. I want to say two years ago. And it has the little infinity sign. It's just super, super cute. Super classy. This one here has two little hearts and this is very special because whenever my mom and I see like a big heart and a little heart or like a, a little statue of like a big polar bear and a little polar bear or anything that's like two of something, um, we always say like me and her since I'm little, since I grew up with no father, so it was just my mom and I. Uh, so everything that is in twos is me and her. So this is from my mom. This one here is the family tree, which is actually super, super special because I don't have a big family, but we are very, very close. Um, and right before my grandmother passed away, I actually got her um, a family tree necklace and a family tree brooch. And it just says family on it. And I believe this is actually from my grandma. So we were just starting to get into family trees. And I just thought it was a really nice addition because it matches what she had. And this little house is my house it's not what it looks like but this is a little house to represent me buying my first house so that was last year and the next one is a little dog because i bought gucci so as soon as i bought my house in june i got gucci in august and i no longer feel alone <laughs> um so that is the little gucci charm and this key represents the key to my home so i believe my mom gave me that one and my latest charm is the 25, so that was just this past January. January 12 is my birthday, so that is when I got this charm. So thank you guys so, so much for watching today's video. If you enjoyed it, definitely leave a like. I have a lot of other jewelry collections that I can actually go through. So if you guys are interested, let me know in the comment section below. And all of my socials are linked down below. So if you want to follow me, if you want to keep up with me, keeping up with Amanda Kate, um, my Instagram is just at brunette princess. And I have some Poshmark link below. I have um, a Twitter. I am a more active on TikTok. I'm really trying here. <laughs> um, I obviously have uh, Snapchat and Instagram as I just mentioned. So those are all linked down below. I forget if I'm forgetting any, but um, you will find those down. And a lot of people love Gucci. High five. High five. A lot of people love Gucci in my videos. Most people actually. High five, baby. High five.
<laughs> so this is Gucci. Um, if you're interested in seeing more of Gucci, my little baby, he does have his own Instagram. It's just at Gucci the Chi. So it is also linked down below. Um, so I know I got a lot of comments, but whenever you see videos, um, he's usually in the background wanting all the attention. So that's my child. That is my little puppy. I also have a ton of discount codes in my description box. So if you want to save money or make money or get cash back while shopping, um, I have those. I have some money saving ones, like some coupon codes, um, a lot of personalized coupon codes. Actually, I've even partnered up with a designer watch brand. So if you're interested in any of those, I know, right? Um, I check them out. And as always, I love you and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.